I'm Tyler. And I'm Ashlyn. The lunches for this week are Monday, pork rib. Tuesday, chicken patty. Wednesday, pizza. Thursday, turkey and gravy. And Friday, cheeseburger. On the 11th, it is market day. Don't forget to tell your parents now to Sandra with Kid Feature. Hi, my name is Sandra and I am interviewing Sophia. So Sophia, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. What is your favorite sport? My favorite sport would have to be horseback riding. What do you like to do outside of school? I like to play with my dogs. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a vet when I grow up. What is your favorite holiday? My favorite holiday is Christmas. What is your favorite animal? My favorite animal is either a dog or a horse. Natasha Jenna with Teacher Feature. Hi, I'm Jenna and I'm interviewing Mrs. Giles. So Mrs. Giles, what is your favorite color? Jenna, my favorite color I'd have to say is green. What do you like most about being a teacher? I like working with students and collaborating with teachers the best. What is your favorite animal? Um, I'm going to have to say my dog, Naya. She's a white lab. What would you ever teach at another school? Um, I don't think I would. I have taught previously in Harvard. I taught third grade um, before I uh, worked here. Why did you want to become a librarian and a computer teacher? Well, when I was home with my children, um, I spent some time taking classes in library science, and um, I really mostly enjoy working with technology and learning new things, and I thought this was a good opportunity for me to um, do that. Thank you. You're welcome. Now to Monique with weather. Hi, I'm Rhiannon, and I'm doing weather. This week's weather is Sunday, December 7th, 36 high, 29 low, and partly cloudy. Monday, December 8th, is 34 high, low, 24, and snow showers. Tuesday, December 9th, <coughs> high of 39 and low of 23, and partly cloudy. Wednesday, December 10th, is high of 34 and low of 26, and partly cloudy. Thursday, December 11th is high of 38 and low of 30 and partly cloudy. Friday, December 12th is for high of 40 and low of 34 and partly cloudy. Now to Thomas with sports. Hello guys, my name is Thomas and I'm doing sports. On Thursday, the 5 and 7 Bears face the Cowboys. On December 17th, the Bears face the Saints. At 8.30 p.m. on December 10th, the Bulls face the Brook at Brooklyn at 8 o'clock p.m. On December 12th, the uh, Bulls face Portland at 7 o'clock p.m. The Bulls face Miami at 6 o'clock p.m. The Blackhawks play Boston at 6 o'clock p.m. On December 13th, the Blackhawks play New York Islanders. On, on December 13th, the Blackhawks play the Calgary at 7 o'clock p.m. Now to have a panel with fun holidays. We have breaking news. The K, the kindergarten through second grade co Christmas concert is on the 10th. Now back to the news. Hi, my name is Hannah and I'm doing fun holidays. December 8th is National Brownie Day. December 9th is National Cookie Day and Christmas Card Day. December 10th is Mustache Day. December 11th is National Do Noodling Day. December 12th is Ice Cream Day and National Pig Day. That was Hannah doing fun holidays. Now to Christian with research. Hello, I'm Christian and I'm doing research. This week at this week we're researching the gigantic flying fox. The gigantic flying fox is the biggest bat in the world. It met, its wingspan measures 12 feet on an adult measures 12 feet 12 feet long from wingtip to wingtip. These bats, bats along with all bats, have bone, have um bones that mimic the skeletal structure of our fingers, which allows them to grab and climb. The they only have four bones though. The third, the four, the fifth, which functions as their thumb, protrudes from, protrudes from where their hand would be if they were a human. When they're flying, they tuck this in, in so that it does not interfere with their aerodynamics. 
this one, this gigantic flying fox is probably not full grown because if you see how big he is in relation to the to this girl, he should be much bigger. So this one's probably an adolescent teenager. Um, these bats look like they can just swoop down, pick you up, and eat you, right? Raw. These are f the gigantic flying fox is a fruit bat. It only eats fruit. It's a herbivore, and bats are one of the few creatures in this entire world that will adopt a will well adopt a baby of its same species even if that baby is not from their own breed brood they will still adopt it say a gigantic flying fox mom was flying saw a baby starving it will give it food and bring it back that's just how their minds work i can't say that for very many humans these bats these bats have a tail. I think th this one is in a reserve. It, these, all bats have a tail, but if you see how this is cut, I think this bat got hurt when it was flying. And since the gigantic flying fox are an endangered species, it's in a reserve probably recovering. Bats have feet just like us, and as we all know, bats sleep upside down with their ring wings wrapped around them as a blanket to provide warmth. That. That's all I have to say for now. I, that's all I have to say about these amazing bats. Now, now to joke of the week. Hi, I'm Nihon. And I'm Rhiannon. And we're doing joke of the week. Knock, knock. Who's there? Breaking. Breaking who? This is breaking news. Let's fix it. <laughs> <laughs> what does a house wear to a special occasion? What? A dress. <laughs> <laughs> knock knock. Who's there? Dwayne. Dwayne who? Dwayne the bathtub. I'm drowning. <laughs> <laughs> Roll the credits. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ashlyn. And I'm Tyler. And we are the main anchors. And I did breaking news. Hi, I'm Sandra and I did kid feature. Hi, I'm Jenna and I did teacher feature. Hi, I'm Hannah, and I did Fun Holidays. Hi, I'm Rhiannon. And I'm Nihon. And we did Joke, Joke of, of the, the week. week. Hi, I'm Thomas, and I did Sports. Bye. Hi, I'm Christian, and I did Research. I'm Kaden. I'm Angelica, and we were the directors. Hi, I'm Monique. Hi, I'm Miss Kelly, and I'm the teacher. Bye! Bye.